It's budget season for Michigan and for the federal government. That means it's time for elected officials to lay the foundation of what our state and country will look like going forward. While Governor Whitmer's budget proposal invests in our Great Lakes and safeguarding them for years to come, the president's budget wants to make a 90% cut to federal funding for our state's most valuable natural resource. And let's be clear, water is just not for recreation. Water is a human right, and Michigan is home to 20% of the world's fresh water supply. In addition, our governor has made investments in ensuring access to health care for our state's most vulnerable populations, and the president wants to reduce our national Medicare budget by $845 billion. Medicare is a program our seniors have paid into all their lives with the promise it would be there when they need it. A country that doesn't take care of all of its people is not a country that will draw the world's best and brightest or invest in our entrepreneurs and job creators. The cuts in the federal budget to protect the Great Lakes don't represent the values of our hardworking people across this great nation, which is why I've introduced a Senate resolution to ensure Michigan's Great Lakes remain a top priority.